this video I want to talk to you about the harmonic pedal on this Feuerisch 2m18 grand piano and in particular how it can be used to enhance naturally spatial sound effects demonstrated by a well-known work by Bach which I'm recording in an average size room in my home. The harmonic pedal envelops played notes with what the encyclopedias refer to as sympathetic resonance. Put simply, the open strings across the piano resonate without being played when a note with a sympathetic frequency is played. There's more about that and how it works in a related video, Introduction to the Harmonic Pedal. The harmonic pedal is described as a three-in-one pedal, as it's at once the traditional damper pedal, which is found independently on the lyra on this Feuerisch 2m18. For ease of use in all musical situations, the harmonic pedal can deliver the damper pedal effect when pressed fully down, so it's instinctive, and when halfway pressed, it delivers that trademark harmonic resonance, which makes this pedal uniquely special. That's to say you don't have to take your foot off the harmonic pedal to search around for other pedals when playing, so it's easy to use and allows you to concentrate completely on the music. Remarkably, this harmonic pedal can also do the job of the sostenuto pedal, also found independently on the lyra, in its traditional place in between the una corda and damper. To give you an example of how this works, I'll play the opening bars of Bach's Toccata. I want to keep the well-known opening clear and crisp, but call on all the piano's harmonic resonance to bathe around the played notes for a spatial effect. The resulting sound produced is quite different from the damper pedal. Now, those long, deep bass notes, vitally important to the drama of the piece. They are played by the feet on the pipe organ pedal board, but on the piano we need to keep our hands free to play the keyboard part in the middle, so the harmonic pedal is the solution. The sostenuto pedal effect is transferred to the harmonic pedal by pressing the damper position all the way down. When I play, the bass octave, then releasing the pedal to halfway to allow the sympathetic resonance to kick in from the broken diminished chord like this. Now I'll play the Toccata and Fugue in D minor with the harmonic pedal only. Listen out for the colours of the harmonic resonance in those pianissimo bars in the fugue, for example. I'll play them without pedal, so when they reappear, you will more easily hear the difference the harmonic pedal makes to Baroque music written for harpsichord or organ on the modern piano. <laughs> 